Hi everyone. So in this video, I will show you that how we create this uh, eight cross eight cross eight LED cube. So starting, firstly you have to uh, take one cardboard or any wooden board or any other similar kind of stuff and uh, drill holes in the cardboard. The two consecutive holes have a difference of 2.4 or 2.5 centimeters. Now take the LEDs and uh, turn one leg of the LED like this. You can turn the negative leg or positive leg, whatever you want. Now turn uh, turn the legs of the LEDs, all the LEDs, and insert the LEDs in the cardboard and solder the uh, solder all the legs. By uh, soldering all the legs, uh, you will have one panel of your LED. Which contains 64 LEDs. This is the, uh, the upper portion. This is the one panel of the LED. So we, uh, totally we have uh, 8 panels. 64 LEDs are in each panel, so totally uh, there are 512 LEDs in the whole LED cube. So, before placing the LEDs in the cardboard, uh, firstly check them that they are working or not. So, you can make a simple circuit on the breadboard for checking that. And in circuit, I have used the 74XC5.5 shift resistors. These shift resistors are controlling the columns of the LED and these are the rows of the LED, 8 rows and 64 columns. The 8 rows are controlled by the microcontroller and uh, the 64 columns are controlled by the 74XC5.5 shift resistor. And these shift resistors are also controlled by the microcontroller. The microcontroller uh, I have used is uh, AVR at uh, Mega 3 2, the 40 pin microcontroller, and because there are so many LEDs in the in this LED cube, then that's why I have used the, uh, the current amplification driver, the ULA2803. So, guys, uh, this 74 LC595 shift resistor is a 8 bit shift resistor. Uh, it is a serial in, serial out and parallel out shift resistor and the 8 resistors are used in, uh, in, in a cascading structure. Now all the uh, PCBs are uh, designed PCBs. I have designed the circuit. Start. Yeah. You can see the uh, designed PCBs. saying that uh, it is a row of a LED cube and this is a column of the LED cube. You can turn on any LED, one LED, multiple LEDs at one time. Uh, it depends on, only on uh, how you program the microcontroller. Like you are turning on this row and you are giving a uh, data bit on to this column. Then this LED will glow, only this LED will glow. Now if you turn on the row 2, this LED will glow row 3 this LED will go. So you can turn on one or multiple LEDs at one time. For watching the uh, animations uh, you, can, you can watch the other videos and uh, if you have any question about the circuit you can comment on the video.